channel after a short break i'm back with no makeup and crazy hair so today we're gonna declutter my makeup room as you can see from the title of the video um i took a short break just because i was very busy planning the wedding and i just didn't have any time to film I just put a ponytail on, tracksuit on, didn't put any makeup on, just because we're gonna be in here. So I decided that finally it's time to declutter this um, makeup room because it's just packed and I just don't know what to do with all this stuff. Um, the furniture, it's very bad, so don't mind that. I was supposed to get like all Ikea drawers and put all my makeup in there but because we were in lockdown i just couldn't and then i didn't have a chance to go to ikea so it's very old stuff like not old but obviously um stuff that i don't really like but as soon as i have time i'm gonna plan a trip to ikea i'm gonna buy all drawers and i'm gonna put my makeup in there because the makeup drawers I have now, they're like all plastic, but we're gonna do that. Um, so if you still didn't subscribe, please do hit the notification bell. If you're into lifestyle vlogs, speed cleans, all this kind of stuff, this is the right channel for you. And without further ado, let's start decluttering all my makeup collection. This pixie package. So I think I'm gonna keep this box. I know it's not really like decluttering, but I think I'm gonna keep this, take out all the makeup, and maybe I'm gonna like put this like somewhere because it looks very nice, I think. This drawer here, there's like all like hair stuff. So kind of like all my hair stuff. I have this white bag here where I am gonna put all stuff I don't need. Just random piece of paper that I don't even know why I have them so I just have a hair straightener then on this drawer here so just a lot of brow stuff and some just stuff for the eyes don't even ask me like where does all of this come from Paper. don't ask me why but I keep all of the papers so this is the um, Raw Beauty by Christie collection just like gel liners that I do love from um, Colourpop so obviously I'm keeping this one uh, maybe I'm gonna put all the pencils in like the little basket so like this uh, this is a L'Oreal brow pencil Um, I don't really like it because it's very like dark like look how dark this is so i'm gonna give this to someone or just give it away then we have a white gel liner like um liquid liner sorry from ColourPop. don't really use white liners but to do some looks you know this is a duo brow from Loretta, uh, they sent this to me ages ago. I used to love this, but I don't really use this kind of stuff anymore. So I don't know, should I keep this? Nah. Then another Beauty by Christy pencil, brown, one of my favorites. So obviously I'm keeping this. Uh, 4.5 goof proof brow pencil. Obviously I'm keeping this because I love Benefit brow products. Uh, this is a brow pencil from Primark. It's a bit dark for me, but it kind of has a nice spoolie. So I'm gonna use it, you know, just for the spoolie. Or I can use it like in an eye makeup. Brow gel. This is a tinted brow gel from Benefit. Obviously, I'm keeping it. Um, well, it's a tinted primer, but you know. Then we have this white eyeliner from Revolution. I know I already have the one from Colourpop, but this is very nice to do makeup looks. Um, Revolution brow pencil. I used to love this and use it all the time before. It is a bit dark. Like, why do I always take all these dark? I'm gonna keep it. You never know. Then one of my favorite pencils, Precision brow pencil from Colourpop black and brown obviously i'm gonna keep this i always use like my benefit brow products like i don't know why i keep all of these but it's nice to have them 
This one from Benefit, I didn't really like this. This is the brow contour um, because the brow stuff finished so quickly, but I still have like the contour stuff, so I'm gonna keep it. Um, liquid liner in blue from Colourpop. I use this and it's stunning. Like, I'm gonna show you. Like, it's a yes from me. Another brow pencil from Benefit. I'm gonna throw this out because it's finished. What is this? A Chanel. Ooh, this is nice. Eyeliner pen in brown. <laughs> Gel liner like in a mustardy color from Colourpop. This is so nice. I love these for doing looks. Then one of my favorite brow pencils from NYX with a hair on it. This is in Espresso. It's a bit dark for me, but I love this pencil. So obviously I'm going to keep it. Um, just a random spoolie that I'm going to try out because it's old. This is a black pencil from Pixie. And I love this because it's so dark as I love it. What else do we have? Another gel liner from Colourpop, obviously keeping. This brow pencil, which is finished from e.l.f. I used to love this. Some glitter, I'm gonna keep it. A white random pencil that I don't know how long I have this, so I'm gonna throw it out. Two eyeliners from L'Oreal. I used to love these, but these are so old. If I put them on my eyes, I don't know what's gonna happen, so <laughs> throw them out. A Stila liner that I used to love, but yeah, it's all dried out. Some more glitter. Tattoo color from Maybelline, all dried out, so I'm, to, I'm not gonna use them anyway, so throw it out. This is from Primark, some glitter, and it's actually stunning, so very hard to use because they go everywhere, but... I'm gonna keep them. You never know. I need to do some look, obviously. One of my favorite gel liners from Suva Beauty. You put some like water and stuff, and this is stunning. All my glitters from Colourpop, obviously, you all know. Like, I love these. These are like the um, Super Shock Shadow, so yes. This one from Beauty by Christy collection, obviously. I love these glitters. I'm just gonna remove all the boxes because I always keep the boxes. Don't ask me why. So like this one, it's stunning. I'm not gonna organize it perfectly because I know I'm gonna change the furniture as soon as I go to Ikea, like in a few weeks maybe. So I'm, you know, I'm gonna put it like normally. And then obviously when I go to Ikea, I'm probably gonna make a vlog. I'm gonna buy like all dividers. But for now, we're just gonna put them like this. This one as well, gorgeous. Why do I have all this paper? This black one as well. Some random glitter from the G Gypsy Dream. This is nice to do looks. Color pop, brow pomade. I used to love this. Oh my god, I'm gonna keep this. I haven't used it in ages. I haven't used a brow pomade in ages. LA Girl pencil, love this. Wet n Wild pencil for like your waterline. I love this. So obviously I'm gonna keep it. Brow pomade from Revolution. I used to love this. Like, I'm gonna keep it. Maybe I'm gonna be into brow pomades one day, you know. Other super shock shadows. This palette from Maybelline, I got it in TK Maxx. It was actually nice. I used to love this palette at the start, you know, um, but don't really use this stuff anymore, so I'm gonna throw it out. Some more pigment from Primer. I'm gonna keep it. Some more Super Shock Shadows. Oh, actually, these are liquid glitter from Colourpops. What is this? Cream gel liner. Love this. I love them. Luna by Lisa um, liquid glitter. Oh my god. These are just sensational. So yes. From Catrice. This is finished but this is one of my favorite brow pencils. If you want to be on a budget like these are so cheap and I love them. Cream gel liner from Colourpop. Oh, these are so hard because they're so pigmented but like sometimes the little tip just gets loose. So, oh, make me brow eyebrow mascara from Essence. One of my favorite brow gels. So obviously I'm gonna keep this. Uh, I have some random stuff that I have to put in other drawers in here. And these drawers, there's probably a lot of stuff that 
Ooh, another eyeliner black, never enough. So yes, liner. Oh, this is gorgeous. Yes. Gel from Essence, my favorite. Yes. Another cream gel liner in white. Yes. One of my favorite brow um, mascara from Rimmel. So obviously. Another Super Shock Shadow. Oh, this one from Luna by Lisa. I used to love this. It's a bit dry now. Actually, it's all dry. Okay. There's more pencils from Benefit. I always have like, oh, this one is finished, so I'm gonna try it out. But I always have like, you know, this one I used to love. I haven't used it in ages, but I will. Bushy Brow from Lime Crime. It's like a brow gel and it's stunning. Kind of like an um, eyeshadow kind of like stick pencil. I'm gonna do a mess, so I'm gonna keep this because this is nice. More pencils another eyeshadow stick look at this how pretty so obviously keep it from pixie color pop brow gel another of my favorite oh this eyeliner i use it in a look it's kind of like a burgundy eyeliner from color pop loved it oh my god one of my favorite pencils i love these pencil from la girl to make looks look at this so pigmented this was like a brow gel from Etamore to kind of like make it like feathery brows, but I just don't use this stuff, so I'm gonna give it to someone that maybe use it more than me. Um, kind of like these are like creamy shadows from ColourPop. This pencil from Collection, I didn't use it in the ages, so I'm gonna throw it out. Glitter from ColourPop. I don't use glitter, so I'm gonna put this maybe in a giveaway i'm gonna show you at the end what i did throw out and i'm what i'm gonna put like in the giveaway stash don't use this from maybelline so throw it out pencil that i haven't used in ages so i'm gonna throw this out like it's just i don't know what brand another color pop brow pencil obviously it's a keeper another gel liner oh another look at this eyeliner i'm gonna keep this it's like a nudie eyeliner some glitter glue always good to have this is from revolution and then another gel liner in like a pinky color look at this oh this is stunning so to use in look so first drawer done we're a bit better then this drawer uh don't even ask me what it is i'm gonna i think it's like lips or something don't even i don't even know I don't even use like look at the colors so no uh, boxes there's hello kitty trio it's so cute but I'm gonna put this in a giveaway because I have so many lip glosses gloss lip from Colourpop uh, oh this is nice so absolutely yes I have to buy dividers because I don't have any dividers from these what is this lip gloss from Primark uh, I don't know, I'm, I don't really use this, so I'm just gonna give it out to someone. Another blushes lip from ColourPop. I used to love these. So obviously I'm keeping this one, I love these. Um, Rimmel lipstick, I don't use this anymore, so no. This is a primer lipstick. I used to use this like all the time. It's a matte one and it's absolutely gorgeous. It's so hard. This is one from Jared Cosmetics. So yes, I love this. I don't know if you can see it. So obviously I'm going to keep it. I only wear lip gloss at the moment. But you know, when I wear lipsticks. What is this? A lippy sticks from Colourpop. Oh, I love these. These are new. Um, a lip gloss from Jared Cosmetics. Yes. This H&M lip gloss, I don't know how many years I have this, so it's time to go in the bin. I don't even know where this is from, so old, gonna throw it out. This one from Clinique, um, throw it out because it's so old. This is a primer one, which it was stunning at the time. Look at this, I'm gonna keep this, oh my god. I haven't used this in ages, like look at this. So Uda Beauty one in Gossip Girl, obviously I'm gonna keep it. 
this is a frozen one from Colourpop. I'm gonna keep this because it looks cute. Plumpet, no, like this is like a plumping thing to like, you know, make your lips plump. But this was so sore and I do have a lot of plumping glosses, but this is a lip gloss from MAC. It's so old, I have to throw it out, but I used to love this. It was so good. This is in Viva Glam V. Oh, I used to love it, but it's too old. So juicy lip gloss. Obviously, I'm gonna keep it from Colourpop. Another so juicy. Um, uh, what is this? Oh, I used to love this, but it's too old, so I'm gonna throw it out. Obviously, from Maybelline Superstay. In what shade is this? Zero five. Obviously, I'm gonna keep it. This is the Lux Party. Oh, these are cute. Lux Lip Vault. I think I'm going to put this in a giveaway because I have loads of these. Or maybe not. I'm going to leave it here and see. Juicy. Yes. Wet and Wild. Don't use it. So, bin. This I used to love it from MAC in the shade Boys Go Crazy. Oh my god, when I was younger. Look at this shade. This is crazy. But no, it's very old. So, I'm just going to, you know, give it to someone or just throw it away. Obviously, Beauty by Christy Lux Gloss. This is stunning, like just stunning. This lip gloss, I love their lip glosses. So yeah, Revlon. Uh, no, these are so old. Shades I don't even wear. Mac, what is this? Uncontrollable. One of my favorite shades. Like, excuse me. So obviously, I'm keeping this. One of my favorite glosses from Rimmel. Oh my gloss. Like if you're looking for a gloss like hydrating, this is the one like, oh my God. I have to buy more shades of that. Then what we have here, another stick from Colourpop keeping. One of my favorite um, lip glosses from Life on a List from Benefit. Very old, so I'm going to throw it out. Smashbox. I used to love these lip tints, but they get dried so easy. Like, this is all dried. And, like, these are so expensive from, from Smashbox. So, obviously, I have to, like, throw it out because it's dried. But Ultra Mass Lip from Colourpop. You, this is very good. Look at this. Obviously, I'm keeping Revlon lipsticks, these are so old, so obviously I'm going to throw them out. This is from, I think, I don't remember the name of the brand, I think the Lanchi, but these are like matte lipsticks and they're very good. It was like a lip vault. So keeping, again, Revlon, I have it from, I don't know how long, throwing it out. Jared Cosmetics, love this lipstick, so creamy. This is in the shade Buttercup, so obviously I am keeping it, you know. So this is an um, hourglass um, matte, oh my god, this is so dirty, but it's a matte um, liquid lipstick. Um, this is so good for like, look at this, for like spring or like, look at this, oh my god, like, I used to love this, so obviously I'm keeping it. Um, this is from Pixie, again, very nice as well, like, you know, for some looks. So obviously I'm keeping this. I need some wipes because like I have to clean my hand. Um, Jared Cosmetics keeping. I have so many pencils in here like. I have so much stuff in these drawers that like are not from these drawers. So again, Rob Beauty by Christy. Another So Juicy keeping Revlon, not using this stick for like your lips, so throwing it out. Scrub from e.l.f., so I'm keeping this. This is very good. So this is Powder Buff Puff from NYX, my favorite like lip cream. Like it's kind of like a um, liquid lipstick. I love this, like just love it. Revlon, obviously throwing it out because it's so old. I have so many Revlons, I don't know why. Maybe they were my sister or something. Revlon. This is the ultra blot lip from Colourpop. What's a bit? I'm gonna keep this. I'm give it a go. Ooh, this lipstick from Colourpop in Oasis. Like, yes. Keeping this. I have a lot of like liquid lipsticks, but they're like all in my bag. So the ones that are here, are, like not all my lipsticks. <laughs> Just like you know, I they're everywhere. Yuda Beauty in Trendsetter, obviously I'm keeping one of my favorites. This is kind of like a lip oil from Jared Cosmetics, very nice, so keeping. 
uh what is this ruby who obviously keeping one of my favorites like this is so random but one of my favorite lipsticks from primer these are from the dust collection i don't know if you can still buy them in supernova but like look at this i love primer lipsticks so obviously i'm keeping it this is a chanel lipstick i don't even use this anymore so i'm gonna throw it out give it to someone like my granny or something like that another little lipstick nyx lingerie i didn't use this in ages but i used to love it so i'm gonna keep it uh, we're not throwing out anything but you know another liquid lipstick from Colourpop this is a MAC lip gloss very old so I'm going to throw it out NYX this is a lovely colour but I don't really wear this stuff so throw it out MAC in there's not even the shade anymore for how old this is this I think is like there's all stuff around it so it's a bad sign throw it out just a tint from Colourpop love these this is a Miami Fever Ofra liquid lipstick I love this as well so obviously this is a MAC one oh so Rimmel very old in the bin this is from Dior I don't even oh this is a nice shade so I'm keeping this Lux lips liquid lip keeping this looks cute so what else do we have uh what is this oh i love this meher i used, used to be my favorite liquid lipstick or not liquid lipstick normal lipstick from mac oh i used to love this from mac this is in retro Mash. oh i'm gonna keep this you find out so many good things when you're doing these videos that you're just like yes please so this drawer here it's all like powders random stuff don't even ask me like powders bronzers that kind of stuff in here like a bit of a highlighters a mixture so sleep palette this is stunning like yes obviously i'm keeping this this is girl meets pearl from benefit i used to love this one of my favorite liquid highlighters but oh it's finished oh it's not finished but it's all separated because it's so old so obviously i have to throw it out So, naked basics, all broken probably, like, I'm gonna throw this out because I don't use it anymore. Catrice highlighter, my favorite, look at this, like, yes, obviously I'm keeping it. Wet n Wild contouring palette, it's a yes from me. Rimmel Stay Matte um, powder, yes, I love it. Lottie London, ready, set and go, I love it. This is a light highlighter from Beauty Big Bang. I just don't like it, so no. Etamore Liquid Illuminator. Very nice, but I don't really use it because I use my Soul Body ones, so no. This is Flawless Eyeliner that I don't even use. Oh, this is so nice. I'm going to keep this. Why it wasn't there? Pure Gold Highlighter from Primark. Like, this is stunning. I don't want to keep everything, but this is stunning. Like... But I just don't use it. Maybe I'm going to use it as an eyeshadow. So, Sleek Liquid Drops Highlighter. I should use this more because these look stunning. So I'm going to keep them. So what do we have? Primer Glitter for Your Body. I don't use this. like So I'm going to give this away because it's just a waste. Colourpop. My hands are all dirty. Colourpop Blush yes we're gonna keep this revolution banana powder obviously we're gonna keep this i'm gonna put them all together because i'm gonna divide them when i'm gonna put my ikea stuff so that's why i'm putting everything together don't worry color pop stick um blush obviously this is a highlighter from pixie it's a bit dark for me but um we're gonna see how we can use it because i think it's lovely so Mm, Jeffree Star powder in fair one of my favorite powders. I haven't used it in ages This dusk highlighter from Primark. I'm gonna give it away because I just don't like it A stick highlighter from Colourpop. Yes, I'm gonna keep this 
This is a banana powder from... What is this brand? I have it on the tip of my tongue. Um, this powder, so I'm going to keep it. MAC blush in Desert Rose. I'm going to keep this. This is a powder from Maybelline Master Fix. I just don't like this powder, so I'm going to give it away. Luna by Lisa highlighter. I think I did like this. Yeah, this is cute. I just broke the container. Beauty Big Bang loose powder. Yeah, it, this is an eye rate. It's cute, so I'm going to keep it. Kiko um, blush. I used to love this, but come on. This is so old in 02, so I'm just going to throw it out. Banana powder by Essence, my favorite. Keeping it. Anastasia blush. Keeping it, obviously. Another contour from Wet n Wild. Contour stick from Maybelline. Obviously, I'm keeping it because I love this. This is a palette like SFX for like Halloween. So I'm going to keep this because maybe I'm going to do some Halloween looks. This is a Technic palette from TK Maxx. I never use this, but these are these are shadows and this bronzer is very cute. So I'm going to keep it. So talk to the palm bronzer from Colourpop one of my favorites so obviously wet and wild blush pearlescent pink obviously keeping it because i love this this leak palette is like um liquid highlighters like you know they're like wet so i'm gonna give this away because i don't really use it mac highlighter i broke it but i love this so i'm keeping it um yeah i'm gonna keep this blush from just the package is very cute from MAC. My sister gave me this. This bronzer, I think it was from Primer, some case, so old, I'm gonna throw it away. Mini Hula, obviously I'm keeping it, my favorite bronzer. This powder, I don't even know how long. Throwing it out. Essence Blush Matte, keeping it. This is a highlighter from Primer. It's very dark for me, but I think it's stunning. So I'm gonna keep it maybe for the body, that kind of stuff. So Luna by Lisa blush, keeping it, I like this. Another lipstick, don't even ask me why this was in here. So, color palette from Technic, like a highlighter. Um, they're very cute, but I don't know, I, I just the shades, you know, I, I don't really use this. Like, it's very nice, like, look at this, but I just don't use this, so I'm gonna give it to someone. Oh, this is a limited edition as well. Another blush from Colourpop, obviously keeping it, I love their blushes. Cody Hairspun, don't even ask me. Obviously, I'm keeping it. Favorite powder ever. This is an ultra glow from Primark. I just don't use this, so I don't know. I could use it like as, you know, maybe as um eyeshadow, like that kind of stuff. So I'm thinking I'm gonna keep it and we'll see. Obviously, highlighter from Wet n Wild. This is in Blossom Glow, love it. So I'm gonna keep it. Revolution um blush palettes i love this so yes keeping it i just find stuff that is like in other drawers don't ask me this is leak palette it's gorgeous but it's all broken and it's a bit dark for me so has to go elf bronzer palette obviously i'm keeping this is very nice this is just like a white loose powder i'm gonna try to use this more MUA powder highlighter. I didn't use this in ages, but I used to love this, so I'm gonna keep this. And then I don't know why I have an empty bottle of Mario Badesco, like why? And then Wet n Wild loose highlighter in New Glow Girl, New Glow Girl. So I'm gonna keep this. So yes, we didn't really throw out a lot of stuff, but I mean, you know, we're trying. I'm probably gonna throw out more stuff when I'm gonna do my IKEA drawers. So, foundation and random stuff. I don't even know where to start. L'Oreal True Match. Love this foundation. So, obviously, it's a keeper. This is a Dior Skin Nude. I used to love this, but this is so old. If I put it on my face, I don't know what's gonna happen. So I need to throw it out, you know. Catrice Liquid Coverage, one of my top 10 favorite foundations. So obviously, Keeper. 
Infallible L'Oreal, absolutely love it. So obviously I am gonna keep this. Revlon, oh, I used to love this, but this is so old, like I need to buy a new one. Yeah, this is all separated, but I'm, I'm gonna buy a new one like as soon as I can. What shade is this? Camoa, 150, I need to put that down. So. Fit Me Maybelline 105, my winter shade, obviously keep it. Wet and Wild Ivory. This is very light for me, but when I mix it with other foundations, this is like a skin prep illuminator from MAC. I haven't used this in ages. Like, oh, this looks nice. This looks nice. I'm gonna keep this. Bourjois LT Makes. Oh my god, I just love this foundation. Mine is in 51, like one of my favorites. So. Obviously, I'm gonna keep it. This kind of like tan for your body from Chanel. I'm gonna throw it out. Like it's kind of like um illuminating thing for your body. It's very nice, but it's very old, so I'm just gonna throw it out. Kiko, um, this is kind of like a foundation with like a little sponge. I used to love this, but this is all finished. This is called the CC cream. Oh, it's a CC cream cushion system. If you see this, you should absolutely try it because I loved it. Obviously, MAC Studio Fix, Keeper, Super Stay. I have two shades. This is Ivory, keeping it. This is a matte primer from Rimmel. I'm keeping this, you never know. This is a concealer, it's so dark. I don't even know why I have it from Benefit, so I'm gonna throw it out because this is so old. So this is a NYX Can Stop One Stop. I'm gonna keep this. Obviously, I love it. This foundation, I never use it from Puda Year Pro Longwear Foundation. So I'm gonna give it out maybe to someone or just, you know, it was actually nice, but I just don't use this, so no. Summer Shade Fit Me 115, keeping it. LA Girl Pro Long Matte. I used to love this, I never use it in Bisque. I need to use it more. Milani 2 in 1 Conceal and like, I love this foundation. This is what shade? creamy nude i need to use this more like favorite concealer palette from mac if you suffer from acne or that kind of stuff like what shade is this light so need to try this out so revolution infinite concealer in 1.5 keeping this infallible concealer in ivory obviously i'm keeping this one of my favorite concealers camouflage essence this breaks me out so i'm gonna throw it away Revolution Conceal and Define. Obviously, I'm keeping this because this is my... Oh, this is the finished one, so I need to throw this out. But I have a backup. Favorite concealer ever. Jeffree Star Concealer in C6. This is one of my favorite concealers. I just love this concealer, like the formula, so I'm keeping it. Eraser Anti-Age from Maybelline in Ivory. Keeping this because I love it. Another Revolution Conceal and Define, obviously, that I'm keeping... Lasting from Rimmel Mars. This is in the shade Ivory. I just don't like this foundation. Like it makes me so dry. So no. This is the Wake Me Up from Rimmel. This was like my all time favorite concealer when I was younger. But this is so old. So in the bin. Another favorite from collection. Very old. So I'm going to buy a new one. So in the bin. This is a Fit Me one from Maybelline. But it's finished. So in the bin again. Contour one from LA Girl, so I'm keeping this. LA Girl Conceal and Define, keeping this. Elf Concealer, the camo one. This is in light peach. It's a bit light, but for like eyeshadows, but I love this. Favorite concealer when I was younger, the Naked one. It's finished from Urban Decay. I used to love this, so. Another favorite concealer, Catrice Camouflage Keeper, so obviously I'm keeping it. I do not know why I have a green highlight, like a green eyeliner and my Anastasia brow pencil in here. Like I'm going to put it in the other drawer. This is a NYX coverage, like a very like full coverage concealer. I used to love this if you like full coverage, but this is so old and it's so thick. Like look at this. But I don't know why I have my Too Faced powder in here. Obviously I'm keeping this, but I'm going to put it in the other drawer. Again, another Rimmel Lasting Matte in True Ivory. Maybe I'm gonna keep one. Let's see how this was. Like, this is so, like, look at the formula. Like, it's like paste. 
it's so dry like it's a nice coverage as well but just when i had acne it just didn't look good like it's actually very nice but it's just no hydration at all so like i don't know it's very matte it's lovely like it's a nice foundation but it's just other super stay shade obviously i'm keeping this um this is a concealer from primark in porcelain i really love this so obviously i'm keeping it color pop concealer keeping it this is the lasting matte from rimmel like it's the same as the foundation i'm keeping this because it's a nice concealer infallible from l'oreal a uh, darker shade keeping it i don't know why i have this eyeshadow thing <laughs> not keeping it just random concealer that it's so pink from Pouda Air. I'm not keeping this. Revolution Conceal and Define Foundation and F3. Keeping this because it's lovely. This, I used to love the True Match Concealer, but I think it's all gone out. Or maybe not. It's actually not gone out. Oh, I'm actually keeping this because this is a lovely concealer. Like, very light. In ivory. I take everything in ivory. Shiseido, I used to love this foundation. It's very old though. It's a natural light ivory. This is, I need to throw it out just because it's so old. Another Conceal and Define, obviously keeping it. I don't know why I have this liquid blush in here. So I need to put that in my blush. Contour stick, I don't know why I have it here. So I'm keeping this. I have this L'Oreal foundation. This is very nice, like the stick foundation. So I'm keeping this. I haven't like worn this in like ages. Another infinite conceal and define for contour, so I'm keeping this. NYX HD, I used to love this, but it's very old, so I'm gonna throw it out. Another Fit Me, I already have one, so I'm gonna throw this out because this is very old. NYX Total Control Foundation, this was my all time favorite. I'm gonna throw it out because it's all separated probably, but this is in the shade Buff Camois, and this was my favorite foundation when I was in college. NARS foundation, obviously I'm keeping it, don't even ask me. Colourpop foundation, obviously I'm keeping it, don't even ask me. Yuda Beauty, too much coverage for me, but I like it when I need to do something, so I'm keeping it. My favourite foundation, worn this way, obviously I'm keeping it like... This is the face and body foundation from Soul Body. I'm still testing this out, but so far it's good. This is like a mixer to whiten up your foundation, so obviously I'm keeping it. And this was like a liquid foundation from Tin Lissy. I just didn't like it, so I'm gonna get a bit away. And then I have this random powder in here. Don't even ask me, so I'm throwing it out. I have here my Uda Beauty concealer. Obviously, I'm keeping it because I love this. So I think we did pretty good with this drawer. Like it's a yes from I have like a lot of like stuff around this room, like just liquid lipsticks like this. Like, you know, I put them like in this um little container, like you know, I just have random lipstick. I have this random drawer. This is mostly like some stuff that my sister left me. So more soul body foundations. I need to test them out, so I'm keeping them. This is just some stuff my sister left, like this MAC. Palette. I'm gonna keep it if, it if I want to add something. A brush from like Soul Beauty, just to, like put your foundation. So obviously I'm keeping this. She left all this random stuff like this, you no know, NARS. I used to love this, but this is so old, like throwing it out. A random powder from Chanel. I'm gonna keep this. This looks nice. Just random. This, oh, this is another palette from MAC. I love this. Obviously, I'm keeping it. This is an Alanage cushion foundation. This is so old. Like, yeah, it's not even in it anymore. So, throwing it out. A little, what is this? Skin Refresher Mist from MAC. So, we are going to keep this. A Day Cream from Nivea. Going to throw it out because it's so old, probably. A liquid lipstick, or actually a normal lipstick, sorry, from L'Oreal. Throwing it out because it's so old. Like, CC cream from Bourjois, throwing it out because I don't want to know how old this is. Estee Lauder, this is nice, like um illuminator. But a blush palette from Lancome. I'm gonna keep this because this looks cute. Dior, this looks lovely, so we're gonna keep this. Sis, bare minerals. You're gonna keep this. This looks cute. 
another cream from Nivea night cream I'm gonna throw this out because I don't even know how long oh look at this eyeshadow from Mac this is stunning oh my god this is in the shade blue sheen so we're gonna keep that obviously um, Lancome again we're gonna keep this uh, some random mascara that's all dry from Lancome so in the bin random you know liquid stuff like lipsticks that it's not even working like lip balms like this so we're just gonna throw them out an hourglass concealer oh this looks nice we're gonna try this out because this looks very cute we're gonna put that in. um a lancome mascara that again it's all dried out this is from Dior and like this is all stuff my sister gave me like don't ask me but she just didn't want it anymore this is so old it even fell from the pot from Dior so what do we have a Rimmel pencil all dried out Laura Mercier I kind of like pencil this is stunning a Laura Mercier concealer that's so thick so it's a no from me Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. My sister used to love this, but I think this is very old. So we can keep this. So what is this? An eyeshadow primer from So Ava. Never used, so we're gonna keep this. Another pencil from Maybelline, very old, in the bin. Roll On from Garnier, in the bin. Brow mascara from Maybelline this is a keeper a Smashbox Trio no I'm just not gonna use this so in the bin a liquid lipstick from 17 like why do I keep saying liquid lipstick this is very old so sorry no eyeshadow color from Maybelline no it's very old copper stick from Laura Mercier this looks stunning like what keeper another Lancome mascara like my sister just loved these mascara but this is dried out so in the bin Bobbi Brown concealer in the bin number seven eyeshadow in the bin because this is very old random pencils in the bin she has concealer but I already have this so this is very old so this one is in the bin Another Lancome mascara. This is a Makeup Forever concealer. I think this used to be very good, but this is so old. So we're just gonna keep in here random stuff. Like I have this dewy set from Anastasia. I'm gonna put in here just some tan from Bare by Vogue, Mac um, Fix Plus. I have this facial mist from. Jared Cosmetics another facial mist from Jared Cosmetics another facial mist from Jared Cosmetics I just love these these are like stunning so all these facial mists so guys I'm very oily looking I just applied some oil on my face um this is the end of the first part of my declutter um I just ended it now because it was gonna be too long so I'm gonna upload the second part so so far we did just some hair stuff random stuff some stuff like old my sister some of my stuff like one of those drawers we did foundations we did like powder bronzers I still have more powder and bronzers in my other drawers and what else we did eyeliners and brow stuff and lip products so I'm gonna upload the second part of like my eyeshadows, mascara, lashes um, after this. And I hope you did enjoy doing this declutter part one with me. So stay tuned for part two. And I'll see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.